Hello my soccer universe! It's a little bit late this video but uh, there's a good reason for it. But first things first, we have two new champions and boy did my videos that I saw, uh, pulled out yesterday age quickly. Manchester City, thanks to Manchester United losing to Leicester and I will include this in a review video of course uh, at the end of next week. Uh, the new Premier League champions and more importantly and a little bit more excitingly Sporting Club to Portugal won yesterday, 1-0 against Boavista and secured their first championship in ages. And I decided, yeah, it's a beautiful jersey, let's have these. Now, this is of course an unpacking video, unpacking, uh, but before that I actually planned something completely different for today. Uh, and unfortunately it didn't work out as I wanted. My I made it yesterday while talking to my wife about new jersey purchases um, and kind of trying to convince her, yeah, this is my plan, da, 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 and this is how I get more jerseys for staying within the budget of maybe, you know, you know stuff like that. I have a problem. I really have a problem. Um, so I wanted to do that. Unfortunately, um, we were using my phone and Either it was connected still to my Bluetooth headset or, some, or something else with it and no sound. So this wonderful interview that my wife did where I really laid all bare did not happen. So yeah, um, what I'm gonna about to reveal to you was of course in there too. Uh, and I'm gonna reveal a little bit but we'll probably do that video because my wife really wants me to have this on video have this publicly available and keep everyone honest on that. Uh, I love her for uh, her willingness to do so, for a keeping me straight. I have a problem with shirts. <laughs> I freely admit it. Um, so yeah, uh, and you gotta be reasonable, but I also wanna get some nice, 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 nice stuff. Um, speaking of nice stuff, it doesn't fit with any of the jerseys in the background that, I, that, that I'm wearing, but at the moment my thoughts for new jerseys are very much centered around France. Uh, there's no doubt about that. Uh, there are some really, really, really nice jerseys, especially in League A. Uh, in there, um, so that's kind of a theme. Uh, going there. However, this is not a Ligue 1 jersey. However, it's still a French jersey. This is, if you watch my video on my favorite jerseys released in 2020, this is my favorite jersey in there. It might not be the f flashiest one out there and so on. It's just it. I love it for the color, for all the references that are in there and overall for being a really well put together jersey. Um, let me show it to you and then I'll tell you how I got this because in the end I only ended up paying four bucks for it for a brand new jersey, although a little bit of a trick in there too. I'm talking of course of the current France home jersey. To me this is an absolute beauty, absolutely. Um, and I will probably make a dedicated video about it, but uh, I have to say this is all the th um, four winning trophy winning jerseys of the French football team put together into one and then it references and it's also in many ways all the Nike jerseys uh, also in there and it still looks super cohesive super French super classy and I give it by the way I really love the return of the red and I also love that the, at least the uh, Breton pattern continues on the back. It is really well put together. I know I have the 2018 World Cup jersey as well. I knew I wanted to get one with the two stars on top like I did uh, in 2000. And that jersey is hanging right there. Where I had the one star so I said yeah gonna get the a uh, two-star jersey for sure and turns out it's a really nice one. I actually like that they changed the logo. I mean, no difference, no unison. Unison? Ah, I've I completely lost all my own French, but they put now something here. The Liberté, Égalité, Fraternité and République Française in there. Really, really, really nice. So how did I only... and it's brand new with tags. I went to the store today and got it. How did I only pay 
uh, four euros for it. Well, trick number one, they had it already on sale for 54. Trick number two, it's in the fav favorite mall. They have twice a year, they uh, pull up all the coupons in exactly the store. And I saw this when I got the PSG jersey uh, recently. Um, they had it for, 50 for, uh, for 54. And now they got the coupons out, and if you spend 50 bucks, they give you 10 off. If you would spend 100, they give you 20 off. Uh, they didn't have any other jerseys really that I was into, so that. Okay, 44. How do I get the last 40 off? Well, uh, fortunately, I have a, a workplace where I've been working now for five consecutive years. And a little thank you, I got a nice plug, and I got coupons for that mall in because it's right there uh, where my work is for 150 or so euros I used a few of those the rest will also get go into jerseys at some point I'm pretty sure so yeah then I said okay the four bucks I get in so pretty nice deal there so I want to know what do you think I am sure I'm probably one of the few that thinks that this is the best jersey released in 2020 I stand by it um, there is just so much beauty in there uh, and it doesn't need to be the flashiest jersey to be the best jersey to be honest so uh, definitely one of, uh, definitely my favorite jersey that I saw uh, released for Euro 2020 and that's running with the uh, current Italy home jersey I like this one even better. Okay, so let me know what you thought about this. Give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed this video. I hope I will bring this uh, interview video to you very soon and I'll talk to you soon. Bye. Hey there, I really hope you enjoyed this video. And if you did, here are some videos and playlists that you might enjoy too. Also, please consider subscribing to my channel as it will keep you updated on all the things that are rotating in my soccer universe. And with that, I wish you a wonderful day. Bye.